Hi, how to send bulk messages with customized information? You can do that with Maxbook Mailer, for example. Maxbook Mailer is our bulk mailer. Let's launch it. When you launch Maxbook Mailer, you can see the message panel and in that message panel a tax pull down menu. It is with that tax pull down menu you can insert customer information right into the message contents. The contents, the data from the recipients are pulled off the recipients lists. So first we have to select a list. I have created once before. So let's select it. It is called sample list. You can see sample list have several columns, first name, surname, company, email address and opt one. Those column names are exactly the same as the tags you can use inside your message. So if you want to insert first name into your message, you have to use the first name tag. So we go back to the message panel and then we can select first name from the a pull down the tag pull down menu. Then we have word for example hi just before and we can see right now in the preview how it look like. Hi Adam, hi Pamela, hi Donald, I'm going through the lists one by one. Hi Edward, hi Angelina, etc. So MacBook Mailer is pulling the data from the list and inserting it into the message in place of the first name tag we have just inserted. We can do the same with all kinds of tags, full name, surname, company, and email address. We can, for example, say inside the message, uh, we are sending, we are sending this message to and the email address. So now we can see in the preview, we are sending this to adam at oddmail.com, at pamela at even.com, at donald at tusk.com, etc. So the information is always pulled from the recipient list. We can also insert customized information, that is, uh, information that is um, completely personalized to each consumer. Uh, Maxbook Mailer has 20 of fields you can use on your own to insert or add any kind of data. For example, we can here uh, add uh, um, in up to one uh, column we have plus some numbers, some reference numbers. So we can in the message field uh, say, for example, um, your reference number is and you insert opt one and now you can see ref your ref number is one two three your ref number is three four five etc all the information pulled out and insert into the message if opt one is not uh, uh, something easy to remember you can of course uh, rename the tag you go here and, for example, you can rename the tag reference. Reference. And you also rename it, it. And here you are. It works. Okay. So, we have also uh, some important and interesting tag uh, for dates, long date, short date, abbreviated, long time, short time, day of week, day, month, month number, year, week of year, day of year, hour, minute, second, etc. You just need to insert the tag as is, for example, long date, and you see the, the, the result right away. Um, you, have, you can also um, insert the creation date, with the modification date and with the last delivery date of this message. The delivery number, so the number, the delivery number that message um, pertain, 
the recipient number in, to, in the list, the total recipients, in, including the list name. You can see here sample list. You can also include an, an unsubscribe uh, tag that will be replaced with an unsubscribe link if you insert the right uh, information in the preferences. Exactly here. Okay. Here we are. I, this is how you can uh, insert uh, um, personalized information into, into the recipient message and uh, it is very easy to do, it is uh, highly recommended because uh, it is a better message that is directed to one person only. The, the person has to think she's the only recipient of the message, so uh, the best you can do is personalize the message the best you can. You can even put uh, personalized information in the subject, it will work as well. Uh, for example, you can put uh, here a first name, here, a first name. You can see here, hey Adam, or hey Pamela. You can even put a exclamation mark, and uh, hey Adam, hey Pamela, etc. It will work. The, um, there are many places where uh, you can insert uh, tags uh, in the in the name field. You can insert the, the, the name of the up to twenty up twenty fields on the reply to on the signature on many places. Okay, here we are. So I hope you you liked this video and you have understood how it works. Thank you for watching.